Phoenix, damage to Interstate 10 could make travel between Phoenix and Los Angeles precarious until the road is repaired, officials warned Thursday, just ahead of the busy Labor Day weekend and the latest bout of punishing monsoonal thunderstorms that have hit the region this summer. The newest round of flooding started Wednesday evening, damaging a roadway that was part of a detour pass to repair project along eastbound Interstate 10 near the small community of Desert Center, California, about 165 miles east of Los Angeles. But the road was reopened with some delays Thursday, according to the California Department of Transportation. Almost 30 people a day travel the freeway. Traffic in both directions was halted initially, but westbound lanes for motorists heading from Arizona to California reopen later. Here's what we know about the damaged highway right now that section of road, between State Route 177 and the California-Arizona border, is undergoing heavy construction, and before the storm, drivers were routed to a bypass to allow for the work. The storm washed out that bypass for eastbound traffic heading toward Arizona. Almost 30 people a day travel the freeway. The area got about three quarters of an inch of rain Wednesday evening, according to the National Weather Service. But the main roadway has a usable eastbound lane, which was reopened Thursday morning, according to Caltrans. Traffic was flowing through the area at 35 to 45 miles per hour just before noon Thursday, according to online monitor Seek Alert. Officials had no estimate on how long it would take to rebuild the eastbound lanes, which means travelers heading from California to Arizona could see continued delays. The washout recalls a similar flash flood in 2015 that took out eastbound lanes of the Tex Wash Bridge on I-10 west of Blythe, stranding hundreds of drivers and forcing lengthy detours throughout the week.